This is a big turkey. Holy cow! Mm -hmm. Anyway, uh, when we was growing up, we had a shitload of chickens. And uh, every time we had company, they go out and butcher the chicken to make something to eat, to have meat to eat. Yes, <laughs> yes. absolutely. That's where I want to be. We want to come back to that. He's in there getting us go juice, guys. It's early. Go juice! Go juice! Good morning and welcome back to Robertson's Belly Acres. You guys, it's early in the morning. I don't do early well. Morning. <laughs> so, um, today's a big day. Headed down to take these birds to get butchered this morning. It's gonna be a good, good day. I can't wait till tomorrow evening. To be able to go back and pick up our, our processed birds. Get ready for that fresh turkey for Christmas dinner. the net for him. Did the goats go, I mean, did the ducks go in the other? Okay, you want me to go put feed in here? Cody, don't let him come back this way, okay? You want the net? Nope. Got real lucky in this thing. I knew that the, way the female turkey shouldn't be able to go right in. All we had to do is kind of push her in a little bit.
this is just really exciting for us guys because this is the first um, bit of poultry that we are going to bring to the farm um, after today uh, or tomorrow I guess when we pick them up we are going to have um, produced uh, pork from our farm and poultry and it's just really exciting this is just the next step for us so we'll we'll touch back um, tomorrow when we well we'll probably go ahead and kind of bring you guys along on this journey here and there um, when we drop them off things like that uh, but we'll we'll definitely uh, show what we end up with uh, after we pick them back up tomorrow yeah definitely we'll show you where what's going on and keep you in the loop let you know how our emotions are doing like I say the, the two turkeys we wound up getting those from a neighbor uh, kind of a kind of a neighborhood birds at, at the beginning they wound up going from one neighbor to the next when the Tom showed up at, my, at our place we I called my buddy and I said hey uh, I think this turkey belongs to you he said if you want him keep him alright well here, fast forward about a month I receive a text from him one day and he says hey so uh this hen's getting get kind of lonely over here without her. Jake, do you mind if taking her or do you want, what do you want me to do? And I said, well, I can either take her or I can send that Jake back across the road to you. And he's, no, 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 we'll figure it out. About three days later, I go, we go out to feed and there she is. She's laying right there on the ground next to that Jake. So Tom and Henrietta is what I call her. Miss Thing is what I call her. <laughs> we try not to name them, honestly. Yeah, we do not name our food. We've got pigs out there. They're pigs. Our chickens are chickens. The ducks are just that. They're ducks. We don't have names for them. We might kind of have a nickname so that we can tell them apart. But otherwise, you don't name your foods. So the policy we've always gone with, so far it seems to work. we are beyond excited right now very excited we've picked them up and 
They are in the cooler, in the back seat, ready to go home and get some cooking done. The prices were phenomenal. The birds are clean and beautiful. We are so excited. Just got back from the bird processors. Ooh, this is the big one. This is a big turkey. Holy cow. Oh my God, is that Miss Thing? That's oh, Miss Thing. Miss Thing. What does the tag say? Processed weight is 24.11 pounds. Wow. That's a big turkey. It's a big one. Yes. It's not frozen, No, she said that it can last up to 10 days in the refrigerator, so she'll be great. To uh, for not to even freeze it. Right? Nope. She threw us in some extra turkey necks. Yep. Oh, to make the gravy. Well, she gave us the two turkey necks and she threw in extra chicken necks oh. so that we could do broths and stuff like that. Yeah. This here would be a goose. Oh, that's our goose. How much did it weigh? That goose weighed 5.6 pounds. Wow. Yes, yes, yes. Uh huh. Yes. One of the ducks. Two point three pounds. That's not sad. That's not sad. Whatever you eat the pork and it comes from the farm. Yeah, but I I've seen those animals. You saw the pigs too. Yeah. Mm -mm. Another duck. Three point two three pounds. Ooh, that one was big. I didn't want to see the pigs. Oh, I'm going to. Oh. And the third duck. Weighing at 2.99 pounds. Well, that's a big one. Yes. And Mr. Jake comes out with a grand total of 16.83 pounds. Wow, that is a lot of meat. Got all of these birds processed. So we got three ducks, a goose, and two turkeys. For grand total of $78. Woohoo! So, how many pounds of meat is this total, Math Whiz? 24, 16 is 38, 69, 3 is 41, and 3 is 44, 549, 51, about 53 pounds total. 53 pounds of meat. Yeah. And the necks for the broth. So and that is. Bag of necks, yes. yes. <laughs> that is awesome. So. Comes out to a, right at $1.47 a pound. Sweet. <laughs> All from our farm. So I hope everybody enjoyed our. Uh, little trip to take these birds down the processor um, it's our first really big step to becoming more self-sufficient uh, we're a long ways from being completely self-sufficient on the farm but we take a lot of pride in what we've got done so far and we've learned a lot of, of valuable lessons and there's a lot more left to learn so here we go we're gonna try to get this figured out and I, like I say, I hope you liked it. If if you did, tell your friends about our channel. And subscribe. And hit that bell button. That way you get notified next time we have a video. But uh, until then, God bless and Merry Christmas from Robertson Belly Acres.